Andy Sinton is alongside me on the Stanley Bowl stand gantry. Last week, Reading certainly got the ball forward early. Today, Swansea will look to dominate possession. How do you cope with Swansea's style? Well, you're right, Nick. They uh, they do like to dominate the ball for me sometimes to the extreme and unnecessary at times. But uh, how do you cope with them? You have to you have to interrupt that. You respect the way they play, but you just can't let them come and dictate the play and dominate all of the possession. Swansea getting ready to get us started just as soon as the whistle blows. To a great extent, it depends on which Queen's Park Rangers turn up. Pal a little bit further forward now, close to the halfway line. Dykes receives. It's a good spread of play. Over to the right to bring in Laird from Dykes. Dykes now making his way into the penalty area. Laird standing up a... Well, I don't know if it was a cross or a shot. It was gathered at the near post by the goalkeeper, Bender. Outside him on the right, just over the halfway line is Laird. Oh, Laird with a good bit of acceleration there. Oh, goodness. It's a clumsy old challenge from Cooper. Swansea marking zonally. In towards the near post, oh. Eddie Goldwoods. Oh, it's a little flick header from Roberts, but he's unfortunate it goes straight through to the goalkeeper, Bender. Well, that's the key, Nick. Anywhere to the side of him because he can't see that till late. It's through a lot of bodies, but it's just straight at him. That's unlucky. Into the feet of field, just short of halfway. Helped on by Irabunam and he's found Roberts. Roberts now right-hand side of midfield to the edge of the box it goes. It's going to drop towards Lolo gets his shot. Yes! J-Lo from the block. It's a booty and it's 1-0 to the Oz. Well, that's a fine finish from Jamal Lowe. It's really well worked. Timur Rabunin plays a nice little ball in the middle of the park. We've got space. Early cross. Lyndon Dykes does well. Falls to Jamal Lowe, but he's still got a lot to do. So Tim Rabunin's touch. Tala Roberts, no hesitation here. Whips it into the area. Lyndon Dykes, good touch, and this is really good. He just works the angle, then comes back across himself into the opposite corner. Really well worked goal from Rangers. A goal on his home debut. A goal on his first start for Jamal Lowe. 1-0 to the arse. Laird is back on his feet. He has had treatment on the pitch, so he'll have to go to the touchline. Let's hope he's all right. Oh, I tell you what, I don't know that he's going to be able to continue. Mm. No, Ozzy Kakai comes on. Tim. Fulton gathers, dispossessed by Iribunum. The half-time whistle goes. Lovely touch from Lyndon Dykes. Crisp finish for a debut home debut goal for Jamal Lowe at the break. Queen's Park Rangers 1, Swansea City 0. And it's hard work against the team that keeps the ball in the way that Swansea do. What have Rangers done well? Exactly what they've done for the last 35 minutes, Nick. I thought Swansea started the better. Their best chances came from set play, so we'll need to keep an eye on that. But we've grown into the game. We've hurried them. I don't mind their two centre-halves having it. They can have it all day long. we just got to block the middle of the park up, pinch it, go and break. We scored a wonderful goal. Still a job to do, though, but so good, so far, so good. Yeah, lots of football still to be played here in this one at the break. It'll be Rangers who get the second half going. They'll be playing from left to right as Andy and I look at it and they will be attacking the Loftus Road end in this second half so a couple at the loft end in the second half a go down lovely Ilias Chair gets the second half going and the ball is knocked back right hand side Kakai takes oh it's a little bit short and that's a handled back pass from the goalkeeper could go anywhere the ricochet you're just hoping it might be your day. He accepts that the players forming the wall have to be on the goal line, but those not on the goal line have to be 10 yards away, and he's laying down some foam to send players wide of yeah, the goal. Yeah, and you get uh, a clear view. You know, Lyndon Dykes, I think, you know, we've seen him the way he takes penalties. Ilias has obviously got a thing, but, you know, someone's just probably going to... Don't be too clever here. It does have to be touched because, of course, it's an indirect free kick. Well, Greek shouts for handball and then as Chair smashes it against the wall and then it comes out to Kakai and his 
shot lacked um, accuracy, shall we say. You know, Nick, this is not easy because you're only seven yards, but you've got about eight bodies conversion. You've got to get really lucky, I feel. And unfortunately there we didn't. That's all you can do, smash it. Bodies coming out the block. That might ricochet into the top corner or anywhere. Field gets it forward to Chair. Chair just over the halfway line, spreads it. It's going to drop for Roberts. Roberts, right-hand side of the penalty area. Oh, goodness, how did that not go in? That's just really good. Tyler Roberts does well less strength, you know, and this is a really good cross. Jamal Lowe's on the way. Left foot volley can do no more. Just gets a little bit unlucky because it bounces up and hits the crossbar. Keeper's beaten. Excellent, Tyler Roberts. Strength, cross. Oh, what a tackle that is from Kenneth Pyle. And Willock takes over. Willock running up the defence. Still Chris Willock. Roberts just outside the D takes over. Tries a curler. It's a good save from Fisher. And not a bad effort at all from Tyler Roberts. Yeah, it works it back onto his left foot. Chrissy Willock. That's good from Chris. Comes inside, drives across the 18-yard box. Finds Tyler Roberts. He shifts it onto his left foot. We can see exactly what he's trying to do. Manning knocks it back to Latibaudier. Born in Doncaster. Oh, it's given away! Oh, goodness, it went straight to Lowe. Lowe stabbed it, goalkey, Goldwoods and Fisher with a crucial save. What a chance for Rangers, Nick. Comes from Swansea. I'm shaking my head, I don't know what they do. I really don't. There you go. Go on, Jamal. Almost wrapped the game up, to be fair. The goalkeeper, he stays big, he makes a good save with his leg. But they're just playing areas that are absolutely ridiculous. Here's Kundal, left-hand side of midfield for Swansea. Gets it wide and back into Kundal. Kundal can think about a shot, instead he finds Fulton. Oh, no. Tucked into the bottom corner. Good finish by Jay Fulton. There's the equaliser. Fourth goal of the season for him, and it's 1-1. 81 minutes played. But are just looking at the goal, Nick. Little reverse from Ryan Manning. Cullen, could he hit it there? He makes the right selection. That's a fine finish. I think it goes through the legs. Is it Jimmy Dunn? It's well worked. There's not much Rangers can do. Maybe get closer to them quicker. But as we're getting close through the through the legs into the bottom corner. And it all comes from a free kick at the yes, other end. And I was just going to say that made the wrong way. Yeah, through the legs of Jimmy Dunn. Sends the ball out for a throw. Chair, clever ball to Willock. Willock, into the box it goes. It's going to come out for Kakai. Thought about a shot. Oh, instead his pass to Adoma was short. And then Kakai. Oh, they won it back. And both Adoma and Kakai were trying to get a hold of it. Eventually Kakai hammers it goalwards and it's blocked. Chair, corner, left-hand side. Up go the heads. And again, a free kick to the defending team. There goes the final whistle. Rangers led through Jamal Lowe. 27 minutes. A goal on his home debut. Jay Fulton tucked in the equaliser. Nine minutes from the end as Swansea showed more attacking attent intent in the second half. Rangers had further opportunities to win it couple of good chances for Jamal Lowe, but it wasn't to be, and it finishes. Queen's Park Rangers won, Swansea City won. Well, credit the Swansea. I thought they came on quite strong towards the game. You know, a couple of substitutions sort of penned us back a little bit. But, you know, Nick, we were 1-0 up. Games, we're talking about managers, and it's often smirked at, or, you know, the people talk about fine margins. The fine margin, success and failure are what it is, fine margins. At 1-0 out, we have a great chance. Swansea dilly-dally and get caught. Jamal Lowe, no blame attached to Jamal. But if that goes in, 2-0, we've got a bit of breathing space. It makes it a little bit easier. Swansea keep going. They make a well-worked goal. Then it's anyone's game in the last 10 minutes. Good game of football. Disappointed that we didn't win the game. From Andy Sinton. Thanks, as always, for your excellent support, guys. And from me, Nick London. We'll see you next time.